Hey guys, I just got a new camera because some of you know my camera that I've had for a long, long, long time actually broke yesterday, officially, completely rest in peace because it's in the garbage right now. So I wanted to do my first video um, on my new camera um, with a diaper bag collection. So this is not accessories, this is just my current diaper bags. Um, some of these I don't use every day, so I will just explain what I use each bag for. So first here I have um, two Superstars. So I have a Sea Ammo Superstar here and a Fairy Tala Superstar here. I only use these for travel because they are massively big. Um, laying down like this, you can't really tell how massive they are, but they are huge. So they open up like that. And I used these when we moved in May from New York to here. We were sort of in a transit, um, like a transit travel state for about 10 days. And this fairy tale one I actually use for 10 days worth of clothes and shoes and things like that for my son and it fit perfectly. Um, although obviously his clothes are small, so for an adult probably 10 days wouldn't work unless you were an extremely light packer. So I use, again, the um, superstars for travel. I'll be using them probably next when we go back to New York for one of the holidays, either Thanksgiving or Christmas. So again, these are not everyday diaper bags. And this is the same bag, but it's in the C ammo print. Like that. So I don't know if I'd really classify them as diaper bags. Probably more of a travel bag. Next up, I have two Super Bs. I have my Toki Perky Super B, which I'm obsessed with. And um, I use my Super Bs. It could be any given day for any specific reason. Um, I used to use them as pool bags, but I have a specific pool bag now. So I don't use these anymore for the pool, um, but I probably still would, maybe occasionally. Um, these I like to use for what I call like a grab-and-go situation. If maybe I'm going somewhere on a whim and I don't really have time to do organized packing, I would use a Super B, and it can fit everything that I keep on my normal diaper bag. But sometimes I would need to throw in my son's blanket. He has a specific blanket. Um, you know, extra toys, you know, a fuel cell. These are just really big bags, and they're sort of my go-to bags. I'm finding that my Super Bs are, overall, I think my favorite Jujube bag currently, because, again, they're just great to just grab, go, you know, throw things in on a whim, because they're not really what I would consider like an organized packing bag. There's no structure to them. They fold up extremely small. So this is my Royal Envy, and, again, that's my Toki Perky. Next up, I have my only remaining Hobo B, which is in the fairy teleprint, and I have a black seatbelt strap attached to it, which is actually from a Petunia Pickle Bottom bag. Um, and I love the Hobo B. Um, it's obviously the smallest of my bags, but I still use it and love it on occasion. Um, this is a more organized packing bag. It hasn't been getting much love lately because I've been using my Skip Hop French Stripe, which I have packed up right now. Um, and I use this right here, I would call like an everyday diaper bag for me currently. Um, some days I switch bags every day. Sometimes I'll use the same bag for a month. Um, there's not really any pattern to when I switch my bags um, or how often I use it, you know, things like that. I'll go through weird phases. But I'm using this one right now as my everyday bag. The same bag is right here, which is my Skip Hop Aztec bag, which I was using until I got the French Stripe. So again, this would be like an everyday bag for me. And lastly, I have my iconic Be Right Back, which I use when I go to um, Carowinds, which is an amusement park. Um, I would specifically use this bag when I go somewhere like that. Not necessarily an amusement park, but somewhere where I need to be completely hands-free. And, you know, obviously I would wear it as a backpack, um, or I would hang it on my stroller. I really like how the Be Right Back hangs on a stroller. Um, everything's just nice and accessible. And, um, yeah, I really like this bag. So, for those who think that I have 100 diaper bags, um, this is literally all I have for diaper bags. And, again, if you don't count the superstars, I really don't have that many bags. Um, if I had every bag that I ever reviewed... A, my husband would kill me, and B, I would probably check myself into a loony bin because that would be crazy. I like to find what works for me, and when I do, I trade or sell bags to be able to fund a new bag. 
I don't have a hundred bags. This is all I have. Um, again, I don't think this is a lot at all compared to some people that I know. And um, this is what I have, and this is what works for me right now. Um, you know, and this bag here would probably be the next bag on the chopping block only because I love my French stripe so much more just because of the pattern I'm just a stripe junkie so currently like I said guys I'm using this right now um, and yeah I just kind of switch out what works for me what I need things like that um, again squashing the rumors right now or whatever people think I've had people message me and say how do you have you know 50 bags I don't this is it. And um, I did order from the new Toki release, the Bubble Trouble. I got another Super B, so it would be this bag here in the new print, which is adorable. And I can't wait to get it in real life to review that for you because I do want to show people how you can pack a Super B. Um, and I love Super Bs for so many reasons. Um, I really love, too, that they don't take up much room. So this is my entire diaper bag collection. Again, if you don't count these two bags, then then that's it so i hope you guys enjoyed um let me know comment down below and let me know if the video the video quality seems better um because again this is my brand new camera and this is the very first video that i'm doing on that camera so i hope you guys enjoyed and have a great day and i will talk to you soon bye